what's up there ladies and gentlemen, today I'm going to show you how you can clean and polish your chrome wheels. Alright, I'm not sure how much of this you guys can see at this angle, I'll do a close up in a little bit, but uh, the procedure I'm about to show you will clean up uh, minor surface rust and corrosion, minor pitting, and also hard water marks, which is what we have here, uh, in addition to some minor surface rust. But as long as the chrome is not physically damaged, the procedure I'm about to show you will clean up any kind of surface corrosion with no problem and also restore the shine of your chrome into I would say almost like new condition. Alright and here's a close up of our wheel. As you can see we got a lot of hard water marks all around this chrome plating and also some minor uh, surface rust inside these dimples here. Now this stuff to someone that hasn't had the misfortune of trying to remove hard water marks looks like it can be easily cleaned with some regular cleaners and, and a towel. And so in here I got some simple green and a microfiber towel and I'm going to try to just try to clean up one area of this wheel with this stuff. We'll see if it makes any difference. So I just spent a couple of minutes trying to clean this area. As you can see, it looks a little better, but you know, we just got the dirt and debris off of it basically. All the hard water marks are still on there. These are not going to go away without a fight. And this is still, even if we spend another 5-10 minutes trying to clean it, it's not going to look like the almost like new finish that we want. Alright, so what I like to use to clean up my chrome wheels is Noxon Metal Polish. And you can find this at Ace Hardware. Uh, I tried looking for it at Home Depot and Lowe's and AutoZone. None of them carried it. The only place they had it was Ace Hardware or you're going to have to buy it online. This works very well on chrome plating. It also works on a bunch of different metals like stainless steel, aluminum, uh, brass, bronze, copper. And something you want to keep in mind though is that if your wheels have uh, paint it or if you have a clear coat on them by any chance you don't want to use this because this could potentially damage those finishes and we're going to be applying our knocks on with some ultra fine steel wool and you want to make sure you get the ultra fine steel wool when you go to your local auto parts store and this is the one with four zeros on it obviously because if you get any of the other kind you could potentially scratch up your chrome and to clean up just a couple of rags it doesn't have to be microfiber towels it could be any cotton towel really and last but not least, some elbow grease, of which I'm sure we got plenty. Alright, and the way we're going to clean this up is just get a piece of steel wool, get some Noxon on it, and then just start rubbing it in. Another good thing about using steel wool is that since it's flexible, you can use it to just get into pretty much anywhere to get to that you know, surface corrosion and rust and clean it all out. I guess I just spent about a minute really to clean this area. Let's wipe it down, see what we have. There you have it folks. As you can see, we've got a really, really nice shine on this now. And here's another shot of the area we just cleaned. Now I don't know if this camera is going to be able to do it justice, but not only were we able to remove all the hard water marks and the surface corrosion, but at the same time you're able to restore a very nice shiny gloss back to this uh, chrome plating we have on here. Alright, so what I'll do next is to clean half of this wheel exactly. I'll give you a shot of that. Then I'll go ahead and finish up and clean the whole thing. Then I'll give you a shot of the final product as well. And here's a good test. Get something with writings on it and see if you can read it through the reflection. We can pretty much make out all the words and the letters that are on this Noxon box through the reflection on all of our chrome plating. And here's the final product. As you can see, we got quite a shine on this. Uh, again, the good thing about using Noxon is that you can not only clean the surface, but at the same time you polish it and you bring it to a very nice shine. And here's another shot of our wheel. I think you guys can tell more clearly here how shiny we exactly get this wheel. And this is the almost like new finish that we were looking for. Alrighty, a couple pointers before I wrap this video up. You want to make sure you wash down your wheel after you clean it because the steel wool we use is going to break apart and the particles that are left over can create surface rust. So you want to get a hose and thoroughly clean it. Also if you are just doing this uh, to polish your chrome wheel and your chrome wheel doesn't have any surface rust or watermarks like we did here, you can get away with just using a terry, uh, a cotton towel and knocks on and you'll get a very nice shine like we did here. With that said, I hope this video helps people out there. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and also consider checking out these other videos I've made. Uh, I'll put them up as links on the screen so you can just click on that.